Wait, 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 should we look at the last episode? Uh, let's... Just look at it and see how the frame you rate Son of a bitch. you make me hit the f***ing start button and then you spear me in the peen? <laughs> Are you kidding me right now? Fine, we can do that. Okay, fine. <laughs> no, no, we don't have to. Oh, no, no, let's do everything James wants to do. Mm, you just better judgment. Nope, nope, nope. Elliot, go. Nope, no. Hey, it's okay. <sighs> Come on. <laughs> oh, sh what time is it? It's time for the Royal Goose. Hi, welcome back to Royal Coops. Last episode, when I said, speaking of weirdos, here's Jen, what I was gonna say is we're both weirdos, and but I, sh it, I didn't get to say that, and I'd like to say that Jen's obviously the coolest one in the house, so I need to explain that, okay, for anyone who thought I was making fun of Jen. Jen's the coolest. Cool. You think Jen's cooler than me? Definitely. What? By a multiplier. What? Yeah. <laughs> This is like non-negotiable. I'm gonna say, let's give out a number 17 times. What? Does that sound about right, Jen? No answer. This is what I'm gonna do in real life. <laughs> Knowing how you ah! really feel about me. <laughs> gonna end it all. You're going in the poop on her? <laughs> oh man, I don't I'm think gonna that... go, Yes, I'm gonna go drown myself in a septic tank. Mm. Been there, done that. Don't recommend it. Jesus. I got a little worm in my penis now. <laughs> I'll go back to Royal Coops. Hi! Everybody. Jen's the greatest, that's all I'm trying to say. I give uh, Jen some crap. I give everyone crap, but Jen doesn't deserve crap. She's too nice. No. Uh, Jen is pretty sweet. Jen's pretty sweet. Alright, so we're just gonna finish up this level here and then we'll be on to the next one pretty Collect quick. Collect all the flying orbs! Okay, so the, um, there's. So because I went to Vancouver, Canada yesterday, there's a story that I've been wanting to share on Royal Goobs for a while now, but I I think now is the perfect time to do so. Just do it! Okay, so back in 2012... Uh, hey, I know you in 2012! There was, um... Back when I was in college, uh, some, some buddies of mine wanted to go on a spring break road trip up into Canada, and Van Shaka, bro. Vancouver was one of the stops, and, uh... I ended up, you know, going along with them, and I was like, here, let's just take my car. Horrible idea, by the way. My car was way too small for five people. Five? On a freaking week-long trip. You took five people in your car? Yeah. The car you currently have? Yeah. Oof. Yeah, it's, uh, <laughs> not, not, not ideal, but, uh... Well, you know, the, the trip had some upsides, like, the, you know, we some of us got really cranky, obviously, and I, I actually got sick during part of the trip, and that really cranky sucked. Bitch. But, um, so, if there's one thing anybody knows about me, it's that I am a very gullible person. Nope. And I was on a road trip with a bunch of other guys that liked to screw with me a good chunk of the time. Because... I've never met anyone who likes to screw with you. Yeah, sure. And, uh, so... <laughs> They, they, they liked to tease and screw with me throughout the whole trip, and they, they weren't like overly mean about it. It's Super Monkey Ball! Super Monkey Ball? That guy! What? Hey, it's me, Super Monkey Ball! What? Put me in the ball and we're gonna go Super Monkey! <laughs> what the hell are you Ooh, talking about? You smell my bananas! I smoked them in a, a secret area! I have no idea what the heck you're talking about. She looked like Super Monkey from a second ago. One of the Super Monkey Ball characters? Yeah. Okay. The main one. Okay, so because um they like to screw with me throughout the trip, here's one thing they they liked to do near the end of our trip, before we um you know crossed back over the Canadian border to come back into America, uh we stopped at this we stopped at this gas station and one of the guys went in and he got uh he got a pack of cards and he said to me, oh by the way James these cards they they're illegal I'm like. What? He's like, they're, they're illegal. We actually can't bring these back into America. Oh, wait, no, they, it wasn't a deck of cards. It was poker chips. Poker. He called them French poker chips. French poker chips. Because, you know, we were in Canada. Yeah. So, <laughs> so, no. so they were poker chips. And he said, these these are like, I can't remember exactly what he said. Yeah. A, a lot of this, I, I can't remember perfectly. So I'm going to get some <gasps> shit wrong. But uh, Fucking this one. Uh, 
he said, yeah, no, the, these, you cannot bring these into America. Like, you know, you can't bring alcohol across the border. You can't bring the, these poker chips across the border. I'm like, okay, you, you've been fucking with me this whole trip. I'm, I'm not falling for this, whatever. Th there, there was a small part of me that was falling for yeah, it, but yeah, I was yeah. like, okay, no, no, no. You didn't want to turn, let him know. Turn up the bullshit meter. They, they're probably screwing with me. Of, of course, they all joined in on the act, and they were like, yeah, yeah, they're illegal. I'm like, okay, sure, whatever. So, we get to the Canadian border, uh -huh. and one of us, um, let's call him Kay, Kay decides to bring a bottle of alcohol mm -hmm. across the border. Mm -hmm. um, but uh, once we get there, the the guard at the border, she checks the back of the, tr of the car, yeah. she opens the trunk, yeah. and there's the bottle of alcohol. She's like, yeah. oh, okay. Mm -hmm. So she ends up bringing us inside. What? And and we're all worried. Yeah. Because, like, I've never been in this situation before. I had no yeah. idea if it was, like, a big deal or not. Mm -hmm. uh, everybody else seemed a bit worried, too. And I was like, oh, jeez, what's going to happen? One of, one of the guys was, like, making jokes, like, oh, they're going to have to check our asses. They're going to have to look up our assholes and make sure we're not smuggling illegal drugs or whatever. And I was like, oh, jeez, okay. I was So we were all getting kind of scared. I was scared, too. And I was like, oh, jeez, what's going to happen? I, I lean over to the guy who told me about the French poker chips. Let's call him Jay. I say, Jay, if, if she asks us about anything, I'm, I'm, I'm just going to tell him the truth about the French poker chips. <laughs> 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 and he, he just starts laughing. He's like, James, I was totally fucking with you the whole time. I was like, oh, god dang it. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever. What, what happened? What ended up um, happening? Everything was fine. It, it, it ended up not being a big deal. Did they just confiscate the booze? Yeah, they just confiscated the booze, and we just went on our way. But yeah, like, he told me, holy shit, James, I was like r really afraid during that whole time. I'd never been stopped at a border before. You saying that made it a lot better. <laughs> that made the whole situation much happier. I'm like, okay then, cool. Dude, that's hilarious. <sighs> Freaking... <laughs> French poker chips. <laughs> oh my god, dude. Yeah. Uh, so, that's that's how gullible I am. Yeah. No, you just. Oh my god. That's. that's I, I was I was a youngin. Yeah. But I, I'm still a youngin, and I can still be quite gullible, as you know. I like to, I like to think I'm not quite as gullible as I used to be, but then but I'm sure Elliot yeah. thinks otherwise, right? Uh, no, I, I don't think you are. Like, compared to when we first started recording... Like two years ago? Yeah, you, I'd, I'd mess with you all the time. You've trained me in the ways of bullshit detection. I guess so. But in part two, I think it's like... We used to hang out a lot more in high school. Um, at least in class. And, uh... I don't know, now we hang out a lot outside of... Well, we don't work or go to school together anymore. So we just hang out in free time, so... Mm -hmm. Hang out a lot more. <laughs> you are not a very gullible person, and I envy you for that. Yeah. Seriously, no, you have you have a very. Oops. <laughs> if anything, I'm too far on the other side, dude. You're like, like too far on the cynical side. Way too far, dude. Someone will tell me something, I'm like, fuck you. <laughs> like, <laughs> dude, yeah, this actually happened this week. Actually, perfect example. Okay, I have a new. There's a new. He's not new. He, he's almost been there for a year now. Holy shit. The new guy at work, who's been there almost for a year now. Yes. Um, he came in. And he told me, he's like, I was like, how are you, man? He's like, uh, I'm all right, dude. Uh, getting to work was kind of crappy. And I was like, what? And he's like, I got rear-ended. And I was like, uh-huh. And he's like, dude, yeah, I was in the Starbucks line in my car. And some guy hit the back of my car. And I was like, yeah, was it real good? Did you, like, break your neck? And uh, was it horrible? And he's like, um, no, but it was bad. And I'm like, oh, uh, yeah, I bet it was real bad. And he's like, <laughs> What are you talking about, man? I'm like, yeah, I'm sure it was just awful how you got hit with the back of your car. And, ooh, I couldn't imagine what it would have been like. And he's like, I don't understand. I'm like, why are you giving me this? Sass? Yeah, yeah, no, he, he said, he's like, I don't understand. And I'm like, um, oh, yeah, you know, I'm sure. Well, next time, try not to get hurt. <laughs> he's just like, okay. What am I saying wrong? Yeah, yeah. And then after that, I was just like, Wait, are you actually being serious? He's like, yes. I'm like, 
Oh, oh, my bad, dude. I thought you were just pulling my leg. And he's like, no. I'm like, that's why I was giving you such weird responses then. He's like, okay. I'm like, yeah, that's actually terrible. I'm so sorry that happened to you. <laughs> that happened this week. <laughs> oh, man. Uh, poor Elliot picking on the new guy without meaning to. <laughs> yeah, dude, pretty much. I'll check this out. Look at, these guys. Look at all them eyes! There's at least two of them! <laughs> but just like me! Um, it, that that kind of reminds me of like how like people who are generally pretty mean or th just think shitty things or screw mm -hmm. with other people all the time, mm -hmm. like they, they generally don't trust other people because they assume that they're thinking the same way, I mm -hmm. guess. Mm. Like, if it wasn't this guy, because we're friends, like we play outside of work and stuff, we play games. Uh-huh. And um, we have we have some in common. Um, he's a cool guy. Uh, so like since we're friends, I you know I'll I'll give him I, you know I'll fuck with him sometimes. Like yeah. not a lot, but as I do with my friends. Um, so I just thought he was giving it right back to me. Uh, okay. But if it's someone you. I don't know very well, then I don't like do that to them. So okay. I'm not just like some random guy. I'm like, sure. Oh, you got diagnosed with uh, <laughs> prostate cancer. Mmm. I'm sure that really sucks, huh? You have gonorrhea of the mouth. <laughs> of sure. The mouth. The mouth. The mouth. <laughs> Yeah, I think, uh... You know what my mooth is good for? What? Ending row. Oops, fuck you. 